Uh, we are back with our self-care golden nuggets for today. And I have a very important, um, or very exciting rather, uh, one to share with you. One that I actually uh, plan to be sharing more of this in my group, in my Facebook group. If you're not in the Facebook group, I invite you to be because um, we have some exciting things that are going on. This week, we're going to talk about boundaries. So boundaries, um, sometimes they're hard to establish uh, or we don't know how to uh, establish boundaries, especially with the ones or the people that are very close to us. And, uh, and sometimes it, it doesn't come easy to establish boundaries with people, to let them know that, hey, I need my space. I need, you know, my time. I need this and I need that. And, um, and there is, then you have your people pleasers. I'm one of them that, uh, want to say yes. and want to just please people because that's just in our nature. And so it's difficult for, uh, people sometimes to, um, establish healthy boundaries and, or sometimes it's frowned upon, or sometimes we, we don't think, or we, we are afraid we're going to hurt somebody's feeling by establishing boundaries. And so, um, all this week, uh, uh we're going to be talking about in the Facebook group. Uh, I have two groups going on, one in English and one in Spanish. Make sure that you join the right language. You know, like if you want to do it in English, it's called self care is for busy moms too. Um, and we're going to be talking about boundaries. The themes are like this. Today, we're going to talk about what are boundaries and why they are important. Tomorrow, we're going to talk about um, no, it's a complete sentence because it is. And we're going to be talking more about that. And also tomorrow, I have a guest speaker in the group. Uh, she is a, a boundaries expert and an aromatherapist as well. And she's going to come and talk to us about boundaries. I think it's very important. I have a lot to learn. So I decided to call in the experts. On Wednesday, we're going to talk about self-care and boundaries. On Thursday, we're going to talk about <coughs> setting boundaries without guilt. I think that's the one that we all struggle with, uh, setting healthy boundaries without guilt. And so that's going to be on Thursday. You don't want to miss that one. On Friday, we're going to talk about taking baby steps. So when you are not used to setting boundaries or when you feel guilty about setting boundaries or, you know, all these feelings uh, that come in, um, we are going to learn how to take baby steps and then celebrate those baby steps big. So um, that's on Friday. And then on Saturday, we're going to talk about how to handle people that are not very happy with our boundaries because you're going to encounter those people. You're going to encounter, you know, especially if they're used to you being there all the time, um, you're going to encounter people like that. You're going to encounter like, well, she used to say yes to me all the time. Why is she saying no now? So we're going to talk about how to handle that, the situation the best you can and, um, you know, wisely and lovingly and everything. So, you know, we can do that. So if you have, if you're not in my group, go ahead and join. Um, again, uh, if you, if you're in this page, you should see the groups right there. I have two in English, one in English and one in Spanish. The guest speaker though will be in my English group only. Um, and I do in the Spanish group, I have a group coaching as well. Uh, on Tuesdays and Thursdays, so you can join. Uh, if you if you prefer uh, the Spanish one, is fine. But note that it's only in Spanish. There's no translation. So I I did that to avoid the translations. <laughs> so um yeah, self care is for busy moms too. That's and I'll put the link when I finish the video. Um, self care is for busy moms too. That's the English one, and then uh, the Spanish call is vida Refres vida simplemente refrescante. That's the Spanish group. So join us this this uh, this week. It's going to be really interesting uh, because boundaries, guys, are necessary. You know, limits is necessary. Even Jesus uh, did this. Uh, if you read through the Gospels, you see that he would often retire, you know, away from people because, you know, he needed to pray. He needed to recharge. So he was setting boundaries, right? And so he teaches us that, that boundaries are Healthy are good for you and good for others as well because you give them a break of you. So there you go. All right. Well, I'll um, 
I will see you tomorrow with another self-care uh, nugget. And um, I hope you join us in our groups. Bye.